So this is the attention exercise. It doesn't matter whether she's sitting or lying down or standing. All that matters is attention. And what we do is we show her that we have a treat. I'm going to hold a treat out here. And when she looks at yes, when she gives me eye contact, I'm going to say yes, that's my clicker, and give her the treat. So what I'm teaching her is, here's a resource, yes, let it go and defer to me. So she's learning that resources come through us. Yes. So this is a very good exercise for teaching them to be calm and focused. Yes. Good girl. As you go along, you want to see if you can bring the resource closer to her face. Yes. And still have her look away. Because resources that are closer are harder to relinquish. So we want it close. <laughs> yes. I'm really just getting eyeballs right now. I prefer her to turn her whole muzzle away, but right now I'm getting eyeballs. So we'll take that for now because that's our window of opportunity. Yes. This is really good if she's ever going to be around little kids. Because little kids, hot dogs and ice cream cones and cookies are right at dog muzzle level. Yes. And we want her to learn that just because it's close to my face doesn't mean it's for me. Yes. And it's important that she looks away so we're getting that disconnect. Because if she's looking at it, and not touching it, she's still mentally connected to it. We want her to see it and go, not mine. And then we reward her. Good girl, Myra. Yes, good girl. Yes, very good girl. Good girl, Lyra. Good girl. 